Hey y'all, it's Happy and Happy back at it again. So here I am going to show you how I did my two space balance with my knotted bang. And there is something very important that I want y'all to know, but I won't say it quite yet. So here is where I'm going ahead and just getting started with my bang, cause I don't waste no time, you feel me? So, what I'm doing right here is just looping the lock around itself. Um, I just did it one time. I literally just looped the lock and put the end through the hole, okay? But here's the thing about that. Um, because when I was trying to take them out, I had a little bit of difficulty. And I would be remiss if I did not mention that difficulty that I faced. <laughs> So, when I was taking the knots out of my bang, I had a couple of them <clears throat> that I didn't pull out right. And so, the knots are still like on the ends of my bangs and I haven't been able to get them out. So, a couple of tips <laughs> from error. Ain't, ain't you glad that some is somebody to tell you what not to do before you do it? Amen. Um, if your ends are still curly and not yet, um, rounded off yet, I suggest doing bantu knots at the end of your bangs versus doing the loops like I'm doing here. Hey, 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 y'all, y'all. Um, anyway... <laughs> So anyway, yes, so I recommend doing that. If your ends are rounded off and you are a bit more mature in your lock journey, I feel like the lock knots should be fine. Um, but if you are not and you still have curly ends, I really would recommend you just treating it like a bantu knot. And what that is, the difference between these and bantu knots is you are not making a loop and tying the ends with bantu knots. You are just wrapping the ends of your hair around each other in a circular motion and securing it with a, rub a rubber band is what I would recommend versus taking your curly ends and just letting it wrap around itself because that is also another way for it to get stuck. And the last thing that we want to do is rip our locks up. Amen. Baby, because I'm only about to be eight months in and i was like i regret this it was so cute the end result was so cute but i just didn't know that that would be the problem i would have to face but um yeah in order for you to avoid running into those same issues i did and you ain't finna come back on my page talking about this girl on youtube told me that i could do this and my locks be all right mm -mm, no ma'am no sir no turkey no ham we ain't finna blame nothing on me. All right. I went ahead and told y'all what it was before y'all did it. So, hey, disclaimer, if you decide to do what you want anyway and you curl the ends, that ain't my fault. I am not liable. Amen? Amen. Um, so, right here, I was just trying to try out different uh, styles. My initial plan was to do the half up, half down style with these bangs. But then I eventually realized that I didn't like it. So, you are going to see me do this and then take it, look at it, and then take it right back down. <laughs> uh, but, I mean, hey, if this is your cup of tea, very, I mean, you do what you do. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you like this style, hey, I am glad to be an inspiration. But that style just really wasn't working for me. Um, so then I tried to turn it into a pineapple and then realized I didn't like that either. <laughs> so, uh, well, I mean, huh. yeah, I, I didn't like that for the occasion for the, you know, what I was going for. So I eventually, now you see me, well, I don't think I'm taking it out yet, but eventually I will. We're going to get there. All right. Um, so yeah. Yep. Now look at me trying to make it taller. I don't care how many rubber bands you put on there. You still ain't finna like it, ma'am. Okay. See what I mean? 
trying to problem solve. Girl, just take it out. <laughs> just take it out. No, just uh-uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so here it is. I changed it, pull all, put all of my hair up into one pineapple. I actually did not mind this hairstyle. It was actually kind of cute to me, but it still wasn't exactly the look that I was going for. So, you will see me taking this one out too. <laughs> but, like I said for the last one, if you love this style, girl, rock it, okay? Don't let what I don't like influence what you don't like. Because although you are subscribed to me, you are not a follower. You're a leader, and that's just that on that like period first of all if you have locks period you're a leader because look at the main and most popular hairstyle in the black community right now it ain't locks so if you decide to get locks you're already a game changer period so don't let nobody tell you that you're not because we are the ones that are embracing our naturalness in its entirety and our hair defies gravity amen amen so yeah don't let nobody tell you that you ain't bad because you are bad period So here stands the moment that we've all been waiting for. <laughs> it's when I finally got to the space buns. Lord. Um. So right here you see I am splitting my hair. Okay, I left with my draw hanging out of my jewelry box. That's embarrassing. Uh, but anyway, I mean, don't don't act like don't act like you you don't tell your house up. You, know, you ain't gonna judge me. Anyway, um, so yeah, this is where I split my hair up. I'm sorry, y'all, <laughs> looking at my back, but this is where I split my hair up. I'm not promoting Bright House, by the way. Uh, I don't even think Bright House is business no more. Anyway, I keep getting sidetracked. Anyway, so yeah, I'm splitting my hair into two even sections, and I'm trying stuff out, being really goofy. Um, so. I was like, maybe I should try the ponytails and see if they work. But then I was like, no, I don't really like the ponytails either. So then that's when I said, well, let me just do buns. And that's where you kind of saw me do a simulation of a bun. Um, and so that was my next thing to do a bun. Hey. And so the next thing you're going to do is see me. Okay, I'm just doing the most. You're gonna see me uh, go ahead and put my hair in a couple of buns. Excuse my undercut because I clearly need to go to Mr. Johnny and get cut. But yeah, this is why I started feeling myself for real. I'm gonna let y'all. So in a minute, you'll see me saying, OMG, this is so cute. But I, I wanted to, uh, I wanted to turn the audio on for y'all to hear it. But um, my video editing editing app is being very silly right now, and um, I just don't really have the time for it. I ain't got the time for the enemy's devices today. I never have time for it any day, but especially not today. Um. So anyway, um. So you see, I have a few flyaways in my bun. So, I was really too lazy to pin them all down, so I just kept tucking them. But, if you wanted your buns to be a little cleaner than mine were, you could always use bobby pins to pin them down. But, I just want to say to be careful with those bobby pins and make sure you're pinning them on the outside of the lock and not through the lock. Because you don't want to put a hole in your locks. Okay, um, I will say that. But as you can see, I'm just cleaning it up. And I'm about finished. And I wore this hairstyle to the Maverick City, Kirk Franklin, House Fire, 
You know what I'm saying? Jonathan McReynolds concert. Yeah. Yeah. This was my little hairstyle. I was really feeling myself for real. So, I'm, I hope that this video was informative and taught y'all something. I hope that you got a laugh out of it. As a matter of fact, you finna... Don't forget to like this video, comment, share, subscribe. Do whatever you need to do to get the word out about this cute style, okay? So now I'm just checking myself out. Oh, and make sure you follow me on Instagram as well. If you're not following me already, what are you really doing? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Until next time, y'all. Bye.